Coach, what happened at the end of the game? I have uh, no idea. I didn't see anything. So uh, it's disappointing it ended that way. Um, credit to them. They kicked our butt. Um, and in, in so many ways, uh, obviously Christian had a special night for them. I made some threes. We had our special night the other day against West Virginia. Dejuan was our spark. They had a spark. And that, you know, you get games like that, um, you know, it happens at home. And uh, I, I thought we started out okay. Uh, we had They had four turnovers to start the game. Um, they didn't get a turnover the rest of the half. Obviously, second chance points was uh, a, a big difference in it. Uh, they had 17 to 13, but our, ours were probably late. Theirs were when it when it really mattered. And uh, I thought we battled Azabuki inside. We battled McCormick, but uh, the guards got downhill. They had 40 points uh, in the paint, and uh, you know that, that's just I think it was 40 to 22. And that's just too many. You got to protect the paint against them, and some of it they got in transition, obviously off our turnovers. Uh, you know I think it was a for our young guys, our new guys. It was a uh, Eye-opening moment, tough environment to play in, and uh, we didn't handle it very well early. Uh, we made a little bit of a push. Some of it, they just missed some shots. But then when they wanted to flex their muscles, they, they did and, and found a way to get it back into 20, kind of like, I guess, in a way, like our game against West Virginia the other day. Bruce, you said you didn't see it, but obviously I some of your coaches were trying to sort through it and, and break it up. I mean, what did I, you – how I did you react specifically? I was going to say cans, and I didn't. I didn't see after it. the game. Just, I, you you win with class, you lose with class. Disappointing that anything had to happen at the end, and uh, you know that's all you can. That's all I can say. I, I, it's probably my fault. I, I but I had told them not to press. I had told them not to foul. I told them back off. But you know the kids are young guys. They they want to play hard. Uh, they they were disappointed, frustrated. Played. You know you you don't want to take that fire out of their belly. But at the same time, uh, you know you got it handle it right and it created a, created a, I guess a bad thing uh, but it, you know again credit to Kansas they kicked our butts no I I have uh, stress and I get I break out during the season and uh, it just happened at a bad time and I told David Sloan it's because of him Bruce is somebody as somebody who loves college basketball, when when something like this happens, just kind of whether you're the coach and uh, it's in disappointing. And, and and um again it should have been avoided. Um, you know, again it's my guys, it's my fault. Uh they obviously just came here with a you know, wanting to have a you know, have a game, compete. And uh, we didn't compete like we needed to and probably a little frustration, especially the young guys. And uh, you know, it it's you know you wish it would have ended a little different uh, and and it didn't that's that's sad I I guess I don't know their guy got you know a technical I don't know what happened I I just didn't see it until after Bruce do you take any issue with Dejuan playing to the final second like I, I that? said I just said if you listen I I don't want to I told them to back off I don't you know but he he's a competitive guy I I don't want to take that fire out of his belly but he also got to be smart and. You know, all we talk about is act right, treat people right, play the right way. And that's that's been our way at K-State. Uh, that came probably, I don't know if Coach Snyder said it, but that's how he brought his guys along. That's what makes K-State special. And, uh, you know, it's, it's it, it, you know, probably shouldn't have happened. So, uh, you know, live, you know they, life lessons, that's what we talk to them about in the, in the uh, locker room. And good fortune, no one got hurt. Um, and hopefully no major situation from it Bruce in regards to the actual game and when it got going how disappointed were you in the start from your team and just kind of how those first Actually, eight or nine okay. minutes went seven to seven shoot if you watch us play uh, most of the time it's seven to nothing or ten to nothing to start so it was seven seven we turned them over four times we made some plays and then uh, you know Christian came in they went small uh, we didn't do a very good job he made some shots got it to but 15 to 7, I think an 8-0 run, if I, I could be wrong. I'm getting old, so I don't always remember exactly. Uh, but, uh, you know, and then we just never could get over the hump uh, to, to make, it, make it tough on them. And some, you know, we took some tough shots. We turned it over. Uh, we didn't give ourselves a chance. Bruce, there in the second half, you called timeout with your team uh, on a 13-2 run when they you just wanted the three. They were just they tired. Were dying. We had three guys ass out. <laughs> so I just – and. 
know, so I just, you know, we I just was trying to give them. A, we were just lucky that they had missed some shots. They missed shots. We just, you know, we we had guys, three different guys, raise their hand to get out. So I figured, hey, maybe stop the. But obviously, it was a bad timeout because then they probably went on a run. I don't know. Sloan had 17 and five, and I know he's one of your young guys. What did he give you tonight? Well, he, he I thought he started poorly. He did, had some of those turnovers early, but he, you know, he can make some plays. He gives, he gets downhill uh, for a little guy. He gets in that paint and makes some, makes some good plays. Uh, got a little pull up jumper, which is nice. Reads the defense. Uh, you know, I, I, you know, he obviously he gave us a lot more than a lot of guys. So, you know, it, it, he's. The only thing is, is is his defensive awareness and his breakdowns. That's you know, but we might have to live with that to to have a little better offense. I don't know. Coach, were you able to look at a, a video of what happened at the end in no, terms of in anything. terms of the melee? I, I'm just I talked to our team. I did not see it, so I don't know. I saw Days on stud. I turned around, shake hands, steal the ball. I, I you know I I turned around to shake hands with Coach Self and their staff and. The next thing I knew, every their guys were running, and and I turned around. That's all I saw. So it's. Uh, yes, I, that's what I said before. I'm just happy nothing major happened to either team where there was a escalated fight or something because that would not be the best thing for for Kansas K State rivalry or for college basketball. And so it's uh, it's a bad bad play at the end. Uh, you know, it's disappointing. Uh, life lessons for our young guys. Hopefully next time they'll, they'll be a little smarter.